I've not seen this in person yet. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited because I am doing a huge beauty bay haul. Some of you might already know if you're into beauty and makeup and that type of thing but beauty bay has a huge huge sale at the minute for Black Friday. Um, it is currently the week commencing Black Friday so today it is Tuesday and Black Friday is on Friday in a few days time but um, this sale started actually last week so basically Beauty Bay have up to 30% off site wide I think it's on literally everything on their website it is insane I've seen so many um, influencers upload videos um, promoting Beauty Bay mine isn't an ad I bought all of these things myself um, so I'm really excited to show you what I have bought today so a lot of these things are for me and some are for Christmas presents I'm going to be including everything in the same haul because the people that I've bought the things for won't be watching so yeah I mean they probably won't be able to guess anyway because I'm buying Christmas presents for quite a lot of people this year which isn't doing very good on my bank balance but it's Christmas so it's got to be done. So today I've not got just one parcel I have two parcels this one is huge and I haven't opened them yet I've been saving them and um, I ordered these things I think early last week the thing with Beauty Bay is it does take quite a while for things to arrive which is a little bit annoying um, but it did get hit in the end so I'm literally desperate to get into here and have a look at what I bought. So if you're interested to see what I got from Beauty Bay then just keep on watching. Please like, comment and subscribe as I always say and yeah I'm almost on 1k so please make sure you subscribe and turn that bell on because as I've said in my past few videos I'm going to be doing a giveaway when I hit 1k so stay tuned for that video. Luckily these boxes aren't that difficult to open because I can never open boxes. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So, the first thing that I can see is... I got the Violet Voss Pro eyeshadows. Um, this is... Does it say what eyeshadow palette is called? It's the Holy Grail palette. So I have never opened this. I'm so excited to open this. Um, so this is just the Violet Voss Pro eyeshadows. I think it's well it says hashtag my holy grail so I think this is the holy grail palette I'm so excited because I've seen so many people with this palette I think it's going to be a, such a statement for me I'm going to open it in a second but this is the f well I only own one eyeshadow palette and um, I only own the Too Faced chocolate bonbon palette and I literally wear it every single day I use it today to create this look along with um, a pink pigment um, so yeah the, that's the only eyeshadow palette I own so I'm so excited to open this also this palette was £30.9p I'm only going to be telling you the prices of the prices now um, not the prices before because I don't have them with me um, but I'm pretty sure this palette was 30 or 20% off so yeah definitely you should definitely just go and get it before it's gone because I've wanted this palette for such a long time so it comes in this black casing when you open the box and here it is it is insane oh my god I've never seen this before so this is what the palette looks like it's like holographic dark purple color if I go like this it's like an ombre but then it's like holographic um, it's also holographic on the back and it just says hashtag my holy grail I have not seen this in person yet look how beautiful that is oh the plastic just fell off but look how beautiful that is it has a few matte shades here it has thanks a latte transition hashtag are you kidding me bestie brownie points teddy bear wine and dine all matte shades and then it has crystal ploof toffee awesome sauce how are you doing chill cool beans beans <laughs> cool beans glamping cranberry smash oh my god this is going to be definitely a new um staple palette for me because i'm so more into like orange and like red looks at the minute i'm really trying to like step up my makeup game kind of thing um obviously the look that i just say isn't like my normal look um so i'm i literally cannot wait to use this wine and dine shade that looks insane and um, these can definitely be good highlight shades I'm going to swatch a couple for you guys so I'm going to swatch hashtag wine and dine 
and toffee. So I'm gonna swatch, oh my God. Okay. That's three swatches from this palette, if you can see. So this is Wine and Dine, this is Toffee, which is a shimmer, and this is Hashtag. So yeah, they look insane. Look how pigmented that glitter is. It's not picking up on the skin as much as it is in real life, but, I mean, on camera, but it literally looks, this palette is insane. I'll just show you a close-up. I'm so happy I bought this. I know it was 30 pounds, but I'm gonna get so much, so much use out of this palette, it's insane. I'm so excited, it's literally just got all the statement colours that you need to like to create brown, orange, red, pink, everything. So that is the first thing that I bought and obviously it comes with this huge full size mirror as well which is insane because I've never had a palette with like a massive mirror on it and that it's just going to be so handy for me and this is just one palette that you can just take everywhere and not have to take loads of different palettes with loads of different shades, you can create a lot of looks with this so you'll probably see this on my channel soon, either creating um, a look that's being requested because I have had some people requesting eyeshadow looks from me, um, so yeah look out for the next thing I got is another eyeshadow palette and this is a Christmas present so this eyeshadow palette is called the the palette is called the Colour Icon 10 Pan Palette Rose in the Air palette and this was £2.81. This is by Wet n Wild. I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to open this because obviously it is a Christmas present but I'm going to show you it just like this. So I won't be able to swatch it because obviously this is a present. I don't want to ruin it. Um, so yeah, it comes with so many shades. It actually says transition on the top and bottom shade. So the, this is like a this is like a bronze kind of colour. This is like a warmer brown colour at the bottom and then it's got two shimmers and then the rest are matte. So I think that is such a good color because obviously you need a lot more mattes than shimmers in my eyes um so you just have this gorgeous copper shade a bit of a darker copper this gorgeous color that is very similar to wine and down dine in the violet boss palette this dark brown color um, this cream color a metallic gold shimmer this really nice like lavender color and then a dark brown shimmer so I think this palette is going to be really good it also says on the back like what eyeshadow look you can do but obviously this is just like a little bit of a stocking filler present I think it is so good and for £2.81 or, or however much it was £2.81 can you really go wrong I think this is insane and they did all they did I think three variations of this palette I preferred this one the most I thought this one had a lot of colors which are very very useful so so this is what the palette looks like and yeah let's get on to the next. The next item actually isn't makeup and this is called the Tangle Angel in colour Precious Pink and this was £7.70 so I have like really long hair as you can see. I am wearing my extensions but my hair is really really long um, naturally so I really wanted a really good Tangle Teaser um, and I used to have a Tangle Teaser a long time ago but it just got so ruined. I think I haven't had one since I was at school or something um, I left school like nearly five years ago so that's just mad um, but yeah this is a Tangle Teaser that I I got and this is like a professional professional detangling brush is what it says but it's such a pretty brush and it's not just like the size of a normal tangle teasers normal detangle teasers they're just like big enough to fit in your hand but this one actually has um I don't even know what this is called it has like the normal hairbrush like stand on it so this is what the tangle teaser looks like and it's just this it's got pink inside and all the little um bristles i totally forgot what it was called it says it's heat re heat resistant anti-static water resistant antibacterial and i do prefer tangle teasers because i think with long hair they really help to not rip out your hair um but yeah i'm really excited to use this this one is meant to be like 15 pound or something and i was never going to pay that so i thought since it's almost half price i'm just gonna go ahead and buy it because i've wanted this for a long long time and i think this is the cutest brush Ever. like in the shape of angel with angel wings and I just think this is absolutely gorgeous they did other styles of this as well they did cherub one they did them in different colours so go and check that out if you want a really good hairbrush so yeah let's get on to the next got I actually got two of these so these are the exact same and this is the over pressed powder um, and this is actually a highlighter in the colour Red Rodeo Drive. So I've been looking at this for a long time and I still wear my Beauty Bay highlight that I got a long time ago from um, Ofra. I love Ofra highlighters but I got two of these because they were really really cheap and I got one for a Christmas present as well as one for me. So these are the mini highlighters if I can actually get this out of the box. But this highlighter was 6 99 and I got two of them. So yeah 
I'm gonna try and get this out. I managed to get the highlighter out. It was actually so difficult to get out. So this is a different packaging to the one that I actually have if it'll focus. It's just like a white box and then it says Ofra um, in triangles. The one that I have is like a circle pan and it's see-through. Um, so it just says Ofra Mini Highlighter Rodeo Drive and this is what it looks like so it's just like i think this is a really good size and it's just like a goldy bronze colored highlighter and i think this is really really pretty um it also comes with a mirror which i think is really good because the other one that i have doesn't come with a mirror and this is literally half the price so i'm gonna swatch this i'm so excited oh my god so this is the color of the highlighter and it actually looks a lot lighter on the skin which I actually really like because I'm not like ridiculously tanned and I didn't want this to like show up and not suit me if you know what I mean because the one that I wear at the minute um, is really really light um so yeah I just think this is such a gorgeous color it looks really really light it looks like a champagne color on the skin and it is absolutely stunning so I I literally cannot wait to use this and I hope whoever receives this as a Christmas present is going to love this as well because I just think this is absolutely gorgeous. So let's get on to the next item. And final item from this box is the Doll Light Highlighter in Like a Diamond and this was £10.50. So I think these are usually like £19 or something. I did see one in Topshop and this is what made me want to buy it. So this is the packaging. It is gorgeous. It's just this pink colour packaging and it says Doll Light on the front and then it says Like a Diamond on top. There was two shades in this. Like a Diamond is the lighty colour and then I think it was, oh, I can't remember the colour, I can't remember what the other one was called but it was more of a gold colour but this is the one that I went for. So this is the packaging, just this gorgeous circle packaging with doll light on it and a little heart and then it says like a diamond on the back so I'm so excited to open this. So if my camera will focus, this is the colour of the highlight and I am so excited to use this. So this is like, I'm going to compare this to the Ofra highlight. Uh, yeah this is a lot lighter so the this is the difference in color so this one is a lot more champagne um but we'll see how it shows up on the skin so i'm gonna swatch this now oh my god i'm so excited so they are kind of similar but you can tell that the other one on top is more gold and this one is more white so yeah i'm I'm so excited to use this because this is definitely like my colour. This is my colour highlight that I would go for. I think this is stunning. It's such a gorgeous champagne colour and it shows up insane on the skin. This is one, well, I was going to say this one might even be brighter than the Ofra one, but it might because it's slightly a lighter shade, but it does really stand out on the skin. But yeah, this looks absolutely insane. And how cute is that with all the little love hearts on there? This one just looked really, really cute and I can't wait to you incorporate this into my makeup routine. Routine Cannot speak. Also, if anyone wants to see any looks with like the eyeshadow palette or anything that I've shown, um, then please just let me know down below because I'd love to do that for you guys. Um, but yeah, this is the final item from this box, so let's get onto the next box. Wow, I bought so much. So this box is so much heavier than the other one. I think it's because I bought some shampoo and conditioner so that's probably what's weighing it down but oh my god this one is wow this one is so much heavier and so much fuller that is what it looks like in the second box I feel like I actually got so many more things so I'm gonna start with the makeup brushes because I got quite a lot of makeup brushes because these were just so insanely cheap so I'm just gonna get my little card because I cannot remember what I ordered so the first thing that I got is the LA Girl Pro Brush Domed Crease Brush and this was £3.50 so this is what the brush looks like I might as well just go and open it this is a 204 domed crease brush I feel like you can never have enough eyeshadow brushes and because I'm I've recently bought the eyeshadow, a new eyeshadow palette I just feel like I need some new brushes to go with them so if I can get into it, these feel really good quality. So this is what the brush looks like. This is an LA Girl brush. I've never had an LA Girl brush before, but this one just looks really, really good. Um, yeah, I really can't wait to use this. I'll see what it says. It says dome shape brush blends color into outer crease for a more defined brush. Brush? D defined look? Yeah, I can't wait to use this. So that is the first brush. I'm not going to open all of them because I feel like this video will just be so long. The next one I got is the LA Girl Pro Brush Blending Brush. And this one was £3.50 as well. 
So this is just more of a standard blending brush. So this one just says ideal for shading and blending color on the crease and eyelids. This is a 203 blending brush. So this one is just a little bit, it's more fluffy than this one. This is more for like defining the eye makeup. So that is that one. And then I also got another one which is the same because this is another Christmas present. Um, literally the 30% off sale is such a good chance to get your Christmas presents because if you've got a friend or relative or your mum or anybody that likes hair and makeup and things like that then they are going to love this uh, this sale. The next one I got is the LA Girl Pro Brush Concealer Brush and I literally do not have a concealer brush so I bought this one so this one was £3.50 as well so they were all £3.50 so this is just like a flat concealer brush and it just says 112 concealer brush precise application for coverage of imperfections and contouring so I'm definitely going to use this when I'm carving around my brows and um, I don't have a concealer brush that so I really needed one so that is the last brush that I got from Beauty Bay from LA Girl so next I go in, I'm going down to shampoo and conditioner because I've recently had my hair done as you can tell it is literally a total different colour um, I did upload a vlog or if I haven't it'll be going up soon but I these are actually freezing wow I bought the total result re, total results color obsessed shampoo and conditioner and these were £4.36 each so these are by matrix and obviously because I've just colored my hair I want to make sure my color stays and um, I don't actually have any color shampoo and I know that matrix is a good salon brand so I thought I would just try this out so these are just the matrix total results color obsessed anti oxidant shampoo for color care so these are what they look like and the thing is they're actually huge as well you get a lot of product in this so i'm just going to see if it says anything on the back i don't think it does um it just says it protects against color fading which is really really good because i don't want my color to fade i don't want to pay more money to get it redone just yet um so these are really really good so they were quite cheap as well because i know shampoo and conditioner is really expensive especially if it's like salon branded um, and then the next thing I got is the Total Results Hello Blondie Shampoo and Conditioner. These are for my mum for Christmas. I know she won't be watching this because she don't want watch, watch. She doesn't watch my videos. But these were the same price, four pound thirty six. And these are just the Matrix Total Results Hello Blondie Chamomile Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, and this just says it softens the feel of hair, detangles, and enhances brilliant shine. Blonde hair is radiant, healthy looking with multi dimensional color. So it just enhances that you your blonde and softens and detangles so I think she's gonna love these because she doesn't have like a really good shampoo and conditioner so I thought I would get these and I'd get myself some as well to try them out so I'm really excited to give her these for Christmas and they really weren't that expensive like eight pound for shampoo and conditioner which is like really good um quality is quite rare so I feel like I just need to take a breather. But the next thing I got, I wasn't actually planning on getting, but I thought I would try it out. So I got the Pro Matte HD Longwear Matte Foundation by LA Girl, and this was $6.99. So this is what the foundation looks like, and I've never tried this foundation. I hope it matches me. I hope it does, because it was really hard to like find a match, because all the colours were either too yellow or too red, and I was just like, it's not working. I can't really find like a nice kind of tan colour. Um, I do have fake tan on at the minute so that is why but this is just the LA Girl Pro Matte HD High Definition Longwear Matte Foundation and I bought this because I saw that it was matte and I love matte foundations and um, I do have quite oily skin and um, so I really love matte foundations over um, dewy foundations and I got the colour Soft Honey it says it's medium to full cover coverage and smooth long wear suede finish so I'm excited to try this so if anyone wants to see this in a video maybe testing this foundation because I've never tried Ellie Girl foundations before so if anyone wants to see like a testing foundation video of this and um, because I did do my revelation rev <laughs> revolution testing foundation video not long ago and um, if anyone wants to see this then let me know because I would love to do that because obviously this is gonna be my first impressions I've never tried it before so if anyone wants to see that please let me know things I got I just two lipsticks this is the Gerard Cosmetics Supreme lip cream um, and then this is the Milani 
matte lip cream. So they're both lip cream, so I think that's like more of a liquid lipstick. So I'm gonna start with the Gerard Cosmetics one. I've never bought from any of these brands before. I was so excited. So this is the Supreme Lip Cream in color Angel Cake, and this one was £8.40. So I'm gonna open this now. So this is what it looks like. It's just like this really nice nude color. I'll do a tiny little swatch. So that is the color of it. It does come up quite a lot pinkier on the skin, but I really like that because I really like a pinky nude lip. Um, and especially because this is a liquid lipstick, it'll definitely stay on a lot longer. So I really, really like this. And again, this was in the shade Angel Cake, which is such a cute name. It's literally such a cute name. So I'm so excited to use this. And that's what it looks like. So it's really, really cute. Um, it hasn't dried down matte yet. I don't know if it's going to dry down matte or if it's just like more of a thick gloss, but I'll let you guys know. So I really like that one. And then the next one I got is the Amore Matte Lip Cream in colour Adorable. And this one was £6.30. And again, this is a Christmas present, so I'm not going to go and swatch it for you guys. But this is the colour. So it is darker than the Gerard Cosmetics. This one is a lot more pink. This is definitely more me. Um, and then this one is a lot more nude and yeah I really really like this colour as well but I am more of like a light, I do like more lighter lip colours than darker so yeah this is like a really nice dark brownie nude but not too dark so yeah this one is really nice as well and again this one was £6.30 so yeah that's everything I bought from Beauty Bay. I feel like I've just I spoke well too fast throughout that so I'm really sorry if I spoke too fast and um, but yeah everything I got got was really really discounted so I definitely definitely um, advise you to go and check out the beauty base sales if you have anyone friends family your brother your sister not your brother well maybe your brother um, your best friend anybody that likes makeup hair um, they also do like electronics like hair dryers straighteners hair brushes all that kind of stuff if anyone likes any of that stuff go and check out beauty bay because they have such a huge sale at the minute um i definitely 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 recommend checking it out i've got some amazing bits and i've saved a lot of money um on getting people these christmas presents so i really hope you enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye guys